There is a group that wants to bring pressure on the Cuban government from the USA by organizing a flotilla of vessels to sail into the Straits of Florida. Remember, if you look at the map, it's 90 miles from Havana to Key West. And in between some of the most lucrative fishing grounds in the world, the Straits of Florida. So this group in Miami wants a whole bunch of vessels to go out there and bring attention to the Cuban people's plight, all right? So the organizer, Jorge Lopez, says, quote, the purpose is to stay on the border, not trespass, stay in international waters, and just let the Cuban people know we're fighting for their freedom so once and for all they can be a free country. So that's what Jorge says. Now, I support Jorge. But I will warn anyone that those are dangerous waters there because of the currents. I have dived those waters and I have sailed those waters. You don't play around the streets of Florida. You wind up in the Bahamas. You fall overboard. Something happens. You get a bad vessel and there's plenty of sharks. Plenty. This is not a joyride. But. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security has issued a warning to anybody who would take a boat into the Florida Straits to protest and said that if you don't get permission from the U.S. Coast Guard to do that, we are going to arrest you and you could face 10 years in prison and a fine of $25,000 a day. So I don't think they're going to arrest anybody, but the threat is being made from the Biden administration. They don't want this flotilla out there. Why? I think it's good if Americans demonstrate on behalf of the Cuban people. But I want it to be done safely and in an organized fashion. Would I alert the U.S. Coast Guard? I sure would. A big Coast Guard base in Key West. You got to call them up. You got to tell them, hey, we're going to do this. We're not going into Cuban waters. You go into Cuban waters, they can detain you. And the Coast Guard can't do anything about it. But you were going to stay outside the Cuban uh, boundary, stay in international waters, okay? And we're going to tell the Cuban people we're with them. What's wrong with that? So why isn't the Biden administration saying, hey, we admire the protest here. It's the right protest, but don't be foolish. Don't be stupid. Don't put yourself or the country in jeopardy. That's what they should say rather than just issuing this threat. Fellow Americans, I am concerned about the U.S. dollar. Huge debt, as you know. Will it stay as the world's reserve currency? That's why now more than ever, I recommend you diversify with gold and silver. And the only company I recommend and have for years is American Hartford Gold. I trust them. I've personally done business with them. They sell physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your IRA, and they make it very easy. So call them right now. Make sure you tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you, and they will give you up to $2,500 of free silver on your first order. Since I have been recommending American Hartford Gold, gold shot up more than 40%. Silver, more than 60%. So don't wait. Call them now. 866-501. 5201 866-501-5201 or text bill to 65532 again that's 866-501-5201 or text bill to 65532 bill o'reilly here thank you for watching this video and make sure you subscribe to the first tv youtube page just hit the big red subscribe button below and you'll get clips and highlights of my program, The No Spin News, every single day. We'll see you soon.